What's up guys and in this video I will show you how to burn music slash a playlist onto a CD. So without further ado, let's start the video. So in this video you will need two things, a disc, CD, whatever and iTunes and of course your music. So I'm now going to insert a CD into my Mac. This has to be a brand new disc, a clear disc, nothing on it, just clear. That's the classic super drive sound. It will say something like you've inserted a disc, there you go. Okay, I'm just going to ignore this, ignore. I'm going to go to iTunes, which is here. I'm going to pick an album from, from this one, the top 40 rap hip hop albums of all time. Probably the Immortal Technique album. So I'm going to go here. I'm going to find it from here. There it is. Right click and do burn playlist to disc yeah that's correct audio yep MP, yeah 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 there you go Okay, so now I have ejected the disc. I just showed you how to burn music, playlist, an album onto a disc. You may be wondering, why do you need to do this? Well, if I bought an album on one username, Apple ID, and I want to give it to another person without them having it licensed on my name, I can burn it to a disc, give it to them, they can burn it onto their computer, and that's legal whereas if I just give them all my music that's illegal 
because they're not paying for it. I mean, this this is the only way you can do it. Also, if I want to listen to the music in my car, on my stereo, on my radio, you know, I got it, I got it in CD format as well, as well as digital download format. So I'm gonna just insert this CD to show you what happens when I put the CD into my Mac. I won't play this because due to copyright reasons and whatever. Once it goes in, it'll say, do you want to burn this to your computer, whatever. And now we'll see what it says. Would you like to import the CD Revolutionary Volume 2 into your iTunes library? Probably not because I burnt it from my computer onto the CD so it'd be silly to vice versa that. So I'm just going to eject that. And as you can see, there's no explicit, just nothing. Eject that, take it out, we'll end the video on that. So that's taken out. Close this. And that's it for this tutorial video. I'll see you guys in the next tutorial. Thanks for now.